management system is all about how you perform work. An organisation could rely on people or procedures or a full-blown ISO management system. Only you can decide what is suitable for your organisation. Okay, a management system just isn't a lot of documentation, representing processes, etc. A management system is your form of assurance. How can you repeat day in and day out to get the outcomes that your stakeholders expect of you? But more importantly, it's actually building that management system so you understand what's, what's required today and into the future. And finally, a management system should reflect a plan, do, check and act approach to business. So many organisations do the plan and the do, but often skimp on the check and the act. That's a leadership decision, and through structure change, we can show you how to implement a management system effectively. The team at Structure Change has a diverse background and experience, from manufacturing, design, supply chain, service delivery, build, construction, you name it, we have been involved with it. What this does is provide you the advantage that when we want to implement a management system, we go as deep as we need to go in terms of value, but we also go as high level as we need to go, so we still have assurance, but without it becoming a cost burden. Our experience in assisting organisations achieve ISO certification has led to two questions. Will it be evolution or revolution? Evolution in the sense that there's already sufficient documentation and artefacts in the organisation that just need to be pulled together to achieve certification, or maybe the organisation has relied on people and verbal instructions. In that case, we'll probably build more of a management system. Either way, it's striking a balance so it doesn't become a cost burden and there's value from the moment the management system is implemented. At Structured Change, we start with the statement, a management system should be measured by the value it brings an organisation, not just compliance to a standard. If it's the latter, well, sometimes you might be building a house of cards. If it's the former, you've got a backbone to innovation and of course, plan, do, check, act. And people will believe in the system that's there in front of them.